Florida Gulf Coast, uh, to their credit, had some of the most amazing digs I have yet to see in college near the end there. That was, that was all of them. We took some really good swings and they, they, they were able to capitalize on what I thought were some truly amazing digs on their side. A little bit deflating for us just to, in the frustrating way that it you know, happened on the other side, a couple one-handed digs and things like that. But that was because they were working just as hard as we were. So the, the week was great. And, uh, and our kids should be proud of the two and one that they did. It's been a long time since Mercer's been able to do that and compete in this third match against a, a huge Florida Gulf Coast team who played really hard. Um, so yeah, I mean, the kids should be proud. Mercer should be proud. I mean, the, the, the fans should be proud. I'm, I'm so happy that we've decided to change the arena and make it this type of environment because I think that's helped the girls as well enjoy their, enjoy their week as they should. Uh, Northern Kentucky and Lipscomb are two of the other best teams in the conference, so we're going to come in and practice hard. That's what we do. The girls have never shied away from coming in and, and knowing that practice is going to make the difference, and we're going to do that. I, you know, I haven't had a chance to watch Lipscomb or Northern Kentucky on video yet, so we may prepare for them Wednesday or Thursday, but the girls are the girls are going to come in. They're going to work as hard as they can. They know a little bit about what they need to get better at. Hopefully, I do too, so that we can work on some specific things. But but mostly, we're just going to we're going to play hard, and that's going to carry our momentum for us.